Hello, hi, how are you? It's Ali. Uh, today I am going to show you how to build up a dynamic contact form uh, with WordPress uh, in WordPress. Uh, um, this is my website. I would like to add a contact form here so the people they can ask me question. So for that we need a uh, plugin, WordPress plugin. This is called NEX Proms. So um, this is currently have a discount offer. You can um, brought it from here. If you buy it, you will get a, a couple of uh, add-on totally free um, so this offer only limited time only okay so so if you can if you want you can buy it and save earlier okay so let's get into the video uh, so we already set up the NEX from you can also install it as a free so this is the good thing mm, you can uh, go to the plugin and then install plugin add new so after that you will write an ex yeah and here you go so you will find the form you can install it it and install it and active the plugin after that you will see a option new option any x from uh, this will appear uh, in the dashboard so go into go inside the any x forms yes after that we'll create a new form okay this might be for from so we can create a new form okay blank um, contact from name your form okay contact from okay create so this will uh, take you a few moment just uh, be patient uh, okay uh, this is the interface you will find after creating your form so first of all we will set up our email don't forget to set up your email so that's mean uh, it's a form address and this is recipients so the email will send if you uh, add your email address here uh, the all email will come here so this is the recipients okay so this is my email i just add it here so it's already set up because uh, it's connected with my wordpress so they find it automatically so so let's go to the from back so we'll create something see where there is all available you can see so click on the name okay this is email address this is phone number and this is query see all appearing one by one so you can change the icon change a uh, label you can add a placeholder so suppose uh, for this I want uh, your name okay your name so I want to place one placeholder I would add placeholder so here you find the placeholder uh, inside inputs so example like um ali hyder so this is how we can add um actually plus holder so inside the input section you can also change the icon there is a ton of icons here uh, whatever you want you can change it anytime so perfect um so let's see so one thing is very important don't forget to validation your form so here and they're asking it's it's a require if it's require mark it require if it's not required don't mark it require okay so you can change the format which what are you want from this field what are you looking for so let's just say text only okay for email address go for the validation is email yeah for the phone number go to the phone number field and uh, go to the validation uh, here we need the phone number and it's required perfect and uh, for the query uh, we can change it to your masses masses yeah I mean masses okay so for the validation it could be any format he can he or she can um, attest anything 
he can send the email inside his uh, text uh, anything he can add so any format required okay it's perfect and everything is done we need a uh, the last thing is a submit button okay so we'll click here HTML elements okay so click on the submit button yeah look we already got the submit button so uh, after that you can customize how to change the color font size everything you can do it from here so this is for now so anyway we can change the uh, style okay we can change the style from here or uh, overall from styling so first thing I want to inform you if you want to change the theme color scheme you must uh, use the premium um, plugin which is you can buy from here if you buy this uh, plugin you will get all the add-on free so buy now and get all add-on once free so I will uh, add a link on the description you can buy from here so after that so we would, would like to change something let's see mm, humanity okay it's look awesome okay as my logo color is a little bit orangey okay so it's safe So it's done. We'll go to the embed. So we'll uh, copy the um, short code. This one, short code. Uh, now done. We copy the short code. Now what we'll do? We'll go to the this uh, this page. Okay. We'll we'll go from here. We'll go to page. Yeah. So um, after that, we'll edit this page. Ask a question. Okay. So this is the same page, any. So after that. I can edit from here I will add something add a another row which will be one column okay so, and the module will be text yeah so we'll add a text module and here we will paste the short code perfect um, just one minute okay let it be saved Let me set from here. Yeah, it's already set. Let me exit Visual Builder and we'll see the contact from. Oh, it's perfect. But one thing, it's a look uh, very big, full skin. I don't like it. Let me change the size change the width okay okay here we go go to the setting module perfect go to the design go to the sizing and here's the width okay so for the desktop we can make it 45 person okay 45 person for the tablet I can make it 80 person for the phone okay it's 80 person it's perfect so let's save it once more time yeah once we're done we'll uh, exit the visual builder Yeah, look at the contact form. I'll try to fill the um, contact form and let's see what happened then. Uh, your name, of course, my name, email address. This will be something, example. Okay, some address on that form. So I can put any number and message. Hey, this is my test email. Okay, so let's see the logs. Submit. Look, this is the thing I love. Okay, it's perfect. So thank you for connecting with us. We'll respond to you shortly. Okay, let's uh, check into the email. Let's get into the email and see if we received the email or not. Uh, so we receive our email. Let's check. Uh, 
here is the email. Uh, don't worry for that because I use my Gmail address. So this is kind of spam for them. This will be your company email address. Okay, this could be from your uh, well, domain email address, right? So anyway, this is the email. You will see like this, okay? This is the pattern. It looks very nice, clean, uh, perfect for me uh, and for my client. They love it. They enjoy it. So this is the thing. Uh, this is the contact form we can make easily with this uh, plugin. I really, really love this plugin for myself and also for my client. So they also love it. Uh, you can change the style, icon, everything, everything from uh, back end uh, from here. So thank you so much for um, checking my video. Please, please uh, don't forget to uh, share my video and uh, um, like my video. Uh, please do subscribe my YouTube channel. Mm, let me know re regarding this contact form. If you need any kind of help, I can be do. I can do it for you. This is my Fiverr account. Uh, I also uh, do. I also take a project from my client from here. If you have any project, you cannot do by yourself you can give it to me you can contact with me from Fiverr and uh, I will get back to you as soon as possible okay uh, look at the I have another client they are very happy they are giving me a good uh, re they write for me good review it's uh, wonderful to have this here thank you so much once again uh, I appreciate to take your time and watch this video um, thank you see you in the next video